No, it's not bad. This part. Watch your hand. Oh, man, that was close. All right. So you got the ball that time. Now we need to make it back up. So you're getting closer. So they're on their third robot today. This is called Spike. Spike is a scorpion. So you build it in stages because they get one that'll just move first. Then they add some sensors. Uh, until we get to the point where it'll move forward and backward and react to a hand in front of it. If, if it senses a hand, then it'll try to strike the hand and, and move back and try to protect the Now, what's it supposed to do? It's supposed to go to the ball like it was the first time and touch it with its tail and then make a sound and then go back. All right, so it's just going to strike the ball. It's not going to sense the ball. Yeah. It's just going by distance, right? Yeah. All right, make it work. It needs to reverse. So that would have worked. You just missed the ball, but then you need to change your program so it backs up. Figure out why that's not retracting. Because it may not be the program and it may not be the build. It may be something with the sensor. Well, it's very hands-on, so hopefully they'll learn how to, to use the computer and follow the instructions that are on the computer. And then another big part of it is problem solving, because typically uh, through the building phase, they'll either get a wire in the wrong place or a piece in the wrong place, and they have to go back and figure out what happened there, or the programming part doesn't work correctly, so they have to go back and problem solve. So that's a big part of it, too. Uh, not getting frustrated when things don't work, but focusing on, okay, what happened, why didn't it work, and how do we fix it? So that's a big part of it. Looks like you're doing some cool stuff? Yeah. What part are you working on now? The, we're working uh, on the tail like so it can touch the object. Right. And then when they finish a certain number of steps, then they come over to the testing table and they run them on the mat. Make sure that they work. Once they get them to work, they take them back and they go to the next step. Thank <laughs> you.